Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Hope you are doing fabulously. So, don't know if you recognize this lovely, lovely bag, but I have a Trini London haul to share with you, and I am very, very excited. So last week I went to Trini London Land, which was a three day pop up, um, basically letting us into the world of Trini London skincare, which I'm so excited um, has launched because when I worked for the brand, basically when it first opened, it was always something even way, 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 way back before the brand launched, uh, launched um, that Trini wanted to um, bring out as well as her makeup. It was all about her skincare. You know if you follow Trini, she knows her stuff. She is the guru, she is the queen of skincare, and anything you need to know, you know Trini's got it at her fingertips. So the fact that she has brought out her own skincare range, I um, I was just so excited. So I had to go down um, to the Trini London land, uh, pop down and see what it was all about. I've only treated myself to one of their products, which is the um, PHA Exfoliant Tiptoe In, which um, I couldn't go crazy and get everything, but hopefully one day I will. But let's just say I've been using this for the last week and my skin feels blooming amazing. Um, the other product that I picked up uh, which I've actually had my eye on over lockdown as well, um, is the Trini London De-Stress Serum. Uh, this is the BFF Serum. It's the one after um, the, the BFF, which has the uh, sun protection in. This um, I just wanted because coming into, well, we're in summer now, I don't like to wear anything much to my face anyway, so you know, coming into summer, I want something really glowy, really glossy, and I'm really used to wearing a tinted moisturizer and then applying concealer where I need it. So this serum is great, and I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna pop it on so you can um, see me apply it. The other one that I've had my eye on, really, really random. I mean, there's so many beautiful products to go and buy, but I had to be, sort of, I had to be very selective as to what I bought on this this one. So this is, I mean, how cool is that packaging? It's quite bright outside, so hopefully you'll be able to see it. It's the Trini London Italics um, Eye Shade, eye, Eyeshadow, which is a cream, um, a cream to powder formula. Sorry, something in my eye, which is totally typical. It's a cream to powder um, formula. This one's called Aurora, hopefully I've, um, uh, said it right. It comes with a little sponge, uh, which basically helps um, keep the product fresh. And that is, I mean, how insane is that? So I'm going to show you that on my eyes later. So I'm <clears throat> going to enjoy a nice cup of tea whilst we're sitting here um, in my lovely, lovely anthropology mug that was kindly gifted to me, actually from someone I used to work with at Trini London um, at our Christmas event. So I thought it was a good idea to bring this one out. And I'm just having a ginger, a fresh ginger and hot water, which is very good for the insides and cleansing and very good for your skin. So I always start my day with a fresh ginger. Um, I used to start actually with a hot water and lemon, but since I suffered um, a year ago from a vestibular migraine, I've actually had to cut citrus out of my diet, or rather now reduce my citrus intake. So instead of starting with citrus, I start with ginger. And from someone who suffers from blotchy skin, eczema skin, I have seen a massive turnaround and I'm seriously convinced, although it's with my gut flora, I seriously am convinced that ginger is helping. But I'm going to, I'm waffling, basically. Let's get on to what on earth this is. So, we all have heard of exfoliating skin. Why do we exfoliate our skin? We exfoliate our skin because we, um, you know, as the days go on, we um, have a build-up of dead skin cells. So, the skin can get quite flaky it can get quite dry and it can get quite uneven. So it's really important to exfoliate your skin so your skin can then renew and rejuvenate, especially overnight as well. And then what you'll find if you do exfoliate your skin, um, for me personally, at least once, once to twice a week, you'll find that not only will your makeup sit better, as skincare is the key to makeup, um, your skin will just look brighter, you'll look 
a lot fresher, you'll look, look glowy, you'll look plumped up. Um, and, you know, I, at the moment I've literally just got skincare on. Um, I've been really working at my skincare recently to get um, a really lo lovely glow so I don't really want to wear much on. So you can use this exfoliant um, morning, morning or evening a couple of days a week. I'd say sort of build up to it. If you want to use it every other day you can, but build up to it slowly. Now, with an exfoliator, you can get exfoliators with beads in and they are, it's quite gritty, and you buff that all over your skin. Um, that's one type of an exfoliator. The other type of exfoliator is, I mean, there's loads out there, but just giving you an example, is glycolic acid. And glycolic acid is quite a harsh chemical that you apply onto cotton wool, and then you sweep it over your skin, and it helps to get rid of any dead skin cells. But if you are super, super sensitive, glycolic acid can irritate. So you may find that you can only use it once every two weeks or even once a week. What Trini has done, geniusly, is um, actually use a completely different ingredient in her exfoliant. So no glycolic acid. She's used, and I'm looking at my notes here to remember it, the PHA polyhydroxy acid. Um, and what this helps to do is it helps to exfoliate the skin, it helps to turn around dull skin and helps to rehydrate the skin as well. So that's the, the polyhydroxy acid, that's the PHA, the ingenious ingredient that is in this product. Um, as well, um, and again, I've got to look at my notes because I'm not going to remember these these um, long words if I'm perfectly honest with you. It's also got um, tree hellos in. I've probably pronounced that completely wrong. I'm really sorry. Um, and that is used to rehydrate the skin as well. And once that goes onto the skin, it sort of acts like a magnet. So it just locks in that moisture. Um, and you're just going to be left with really gorgeous exfoliated skin. I'm going to have a look on my notes on my phone as well just to see if I've left anything out. There's also, again apologies for the pronunciation, glycine bonded azelaic acid which um, helps to pacify skin that's in a pickle. This is all from Trini's um, website. Calming angry stressed out complexions which makes a formula all the more suitable for everybody. So this exfoliation, um, this uh, tiptoe in exfoliator is for everybody um, and it also has a second PHA lactobionic acid this is why I need my notes uh, which also works to slosh away dead skin cells to reveal the natural radiance that was always there so you exfo exfoliate gently it boosts radiance it replenishes moisture and it's kind to sensitive skin I think if I was still working for Trini um, I'd have all of these um, ingredients at the uh, at my fingertips but never mind what I also like about this product so a lot of a lot of creams out there and products have a twisty lid you open the lid and the air the cream is then exposed to the air and what can happen for example if you've got a cream with hyaluronic acid in is that the it all can start to evaporate and the products can also start to not work as long. So what Trini's done, which um, another skincare brand that I love and adore using that's designed in Switzerland, um, is using it in a twist pump. So you, bas whoops, you basically don't want to uh, press the button and fly over onto the carpet before a, a viewing. Oopsie. Okay, I was just trying to show you that it's a refillable bottle. Yes, it's refillable, guys. So once you run out of this, don't throw your packaging away. Throw this away and just get your um, refillable exfoliant. And I love that. And it's got a little twist as well. So it twists up and down. Can you see that? All, all from the bottom. So I've done my skincare already, but I'm just going to show you for the sake of today. I'm going to put a couple of pumps on. Now you do not need a cotton wool with this, okay? And then I'm gonna pop this all over. I know I've got skincare on already, but it doesn't matter, just so you can see it. But if you had nothing on your skin, you would see such a gorgeous glow to your skin. It's actually amazing. And then what you would then do is finish with the rest of the Trini London line. 
um, if you have it or finish it with your moisturiser and then once you finish your moisturiser you can go and treat yourself to the rest of the range. So that's on the skin. Immediately, can you see that glow? I don't even have highlighter on my skin guys. Like that is all, all I have on is mascara, a bit of concealer. You'll have to excuse my eczema on my eye but you know it just comes and goes when it wants to doesn't it? <clears throat> um, so immediately it wakes the skin up. How it exfoliates the skin without a cotton pad, I haven't really worked out yet. I think the ingredients just literally, it just dissolves the, it probably just dissolves the dead skin cells. I haven't worked, I just don't know the whole science. I'm going to have to sit down with the guys at Trini and find out the whole science behind this. But all I will say is that for someone who has very sensitive skin, I am not reacting to this product. So, um, and two pumps is what she says as well. Don't forget your decolletage as well, or decollete, however you want to pronounce it. There we go, pop it down there as well, because we do age down there, and we do want to still make this area look lovely. I mean, I'm getting a little bit crepey in the old cleavage area. So anyway, so it's gone on to there. And she actually says to use twice a week and build up to nightly use for an exfoliation boost. Use, oh yeah, use twice a week and build up to nightly use. Nightly use is probably the best time you want to use it. But in the morning, if you really want that extra exfoliation and glow, then, and boost, then you can use it in the morning. So I'm gonna come really, really close up so you can see the skin. Just really lovely, it just wakes the skin up and sort of, you know, it's, it's prepping it guys. It's prepping it for your makeup going on. So I'm gonna stop baffling and say, treat yourself to this, okay? Treat yourself. All righty, um, let's move on to BFF serum. Okay, so there was BFF, which was a cream that had a SPF in and it came out white and it then um you know got it in different colours light light medium medium dark etc etc and it sort of like adapts to your skin tone it evens your skin tone out gives the most wicked glow to your skin and most importantly has that skincare protection um the serum as where it's where it's sort of different is this is a, automatically a tinted serum. It has no SPF. So all I would say guys is make sure you apply your SPF. For the sake of today, I'm not doing it just to show you um, the product, but make sure you apply your SPF before um, you pop this on. So I'm um, gonna pop, have a look at a little of my notes. If you're feeling stressed, if your skin is feeling stressed, it can feel, it can look dull, it can look lifeless. Um, and you just want to pick it up. So we've already done that with the Tiptoe In Exfoliator. The next step we're gonna do is pop this on. So uh, to de-stress skin from within, it's got an um, NP Triox technology to help manage stress on your skin. I have to read these notes because I just can't remember. There's so, there's a lot of technology that has gone into Trini London's skincare and makeup line. And I think I'd have to be reading for a solid couple of weeks to have everything at my fingertips. But anyway, I'm sure you don't mind. Um, it has hyaluronic acid in. I do know about that one. Um, and hyaluronic acid, as we know, should be used in all of our skincare every single day, once or twice a day. So if you don't use it in your skincare, make sure it's in your makeup, but really you need it in your skincare. Because what hyaluronic acid does is it helps to rehydrate your skin and plump it up. And as we um, go in the direction, I'll say go in the direction to 40, um, our skin does need plumping up and we still want it to look nice and youthful, especially after having two children who basically tire the living daylights out of you. So hyaluronic acid, love that. Um, and what else do we have on it on here? Let's have a little look. I'm gonna go back onto my notes, onto the de-stress. I suppose the big question to most of you guys is, how do you know which product to use? Do I use my BFF or do I use my de-stress? The answer is use both. So you can use your BFF to put your sun protection on your skin. It's, it's a sun factor, I can't remember the sun factor, maybe a 30, but I could be wrong. It may be a 50, 30 or 50. 
I should really check that out. Anyway, um, I'll reconfirm the notes below. Um, so you can put that on and then put your, your BFF uh, serum on top of it. Um, if you don't want to apply so many layers, then you can just use your own SPF and then put the BFF serum over the top. And then in areas that you want to conceal a little bit more, go in with your Just a Touch to even the complexion out a little bit more. Rather than plastering foundation onto the skin, this is why she has created a serum, a tinted serum, and it's blooming genius. Um, I just want to read you something on here um, because it's very, very interesting. So we've already discussed the science behind it having the hyaluronic acid to instantly plump and smooth your skin, making it feel and look rested. We all want that. Um, the unique scientifically proven NP Triox technology combi combines five times the average active concentration of neuro furoline. I mean, Trini, what are you doing to me? I cannot pronounce this. Let me say, neuro, neurofroline, Philippa, for goodness sake. Okay, our unique scientifically proven MP triax technology combines five times the average active concentration of neurofroline, allowing your skin to manage stress better during the day and regenerate efficiently. It's a long lasting protection, continuing to improve and transform your skin over time and making it look fresher and brighter as the day goes on. Our triple broad spectrum antioxidant complex boosts the skin's antioxidant balance, neutralising cortisol, which we all want, you know, when we're stressed, and stimulates collagen production to defend and protect the skin from daily life stresses. So BFF, de-stress, blah, blah, de-stress, is something that you need in your life all the time. Um, there's a lot of science that has gone in behind this product, guys, and you know there are great ingredients that have gone into it to de-stress your skin. So... Without further ado, I, today, am Leslie. Leslie, oh bless Leslie, Le Leslie's, uh, Leslie was my boss when I was um, at Trini. Anyway, I'm baffling, that's Leslie. So um, for me, I'd say, yeah, it's pretty much a good color for the summer. Um, I'm just gonna place it in areas around the skin. Let's just go in on one half of my skin, okay? And I'll do the other half afterwards. Just avoid the hair if you can. Avoid, avoid. It smells. It smells really yummy as well. I like that. I'm just going to put a bit more on this side. So let's go a little bit closer. Again, excuse my eczema eye in the corner. I think that's retinal that's affecting me at the moment. So very very light layer i've applied on one side of my face what have i done with it where's it gone here we go and like you can, it doesn't really matter how much you apply if you want to apply a bit more apply a bit more mm. smells just like summer it smells very sweet actually don't know what the ingredients is so and i'm, I'm gonna i'm just tapping it gently into the skin always like to do that can you have a look so, if you see the difference between, I'm gonna go back a little bit, the difference between the two, two sides, my skin is still looking like skin, okay? But what it's doing is it's just evening it out and giving me a nice luminous glow, okay? And just evening my skin tone out. Because my skin is clear, aside from this spot or bite, which I do need to cover up with just a touch in a minute. Um, there we go, there we have it. I'm gonna even myself up on the other side. You'll notice as well when you apply this is um, I just it goes on really easily. So you know you do not need to have any degree in makeup application to apply this, guys. Don't forget your neck. Just whatever's left on your hands. So I just bring it down the neck so you don't have that horrible '90s foundation line. Um, and then. I just, I press in to the skin now, just to warm it in. There's a lot you can do with your hands, guys. I'm, if you follow my videos, you'll know I'm a, a big hands-on makeup applier. A bit like Pat McGrath as well. She loves using her hands. Okay. There we have it. Um, let's make sure it's blended through to the hairline. Uh, into there. 
and I'd probably say it's a really similar consistency basically to a tinted moisturiser um, and look at that let's hold this up I've got an extra light can you see the skin here I just think it looks amazing really amazing oh lovely a lorry's just arrived in time for my filming every time I swear I sit down to do filming builders arrive a lorry arrives collecting a skip so if you hear any background noise that's it so anyway here we go guys some extra light just so you can see what's going on and there you have it that's BFF and in terms of longevity I would say that you know you get a good days you it lasts it lasts the whole day this bff the areas that you may want to top up naturally will be sort of around the nose the chin anywhere where redness is coming out basically so there we go um i'm just going to um touch up my skin just so that um I sort of finished the look off with the Trini London products, so I'm going to do this all in fast forward and then I'm going to show you the eyeshadow as well. So that's my Trini London stack. I have probably quadrupled that upstairs, but I just want to go in with Santa, which is just the dust to touch, this one here, because I have, I think I got bitten yesterday when I went out for lunch. And so I just want to zap that away. Actually, I should probably mix it a bit with Amelia, but Amelia is upstairs. Or is not Amelia, Zandy. Never mind. It will do for the sake of today, it's fine, because I will bronze my thingy after it. I like to put a tiny bit of just a touch around the nose, because that's where we get red. It's just an extra bit of protection. Just either side of the nose. And a little bit on the chin. Nowhere else needs covering, so I'm not going to cover it, okay? Alrighty, I'm going to, you can just watch and learn, and I'm going to um, apply. Swala, bit of bronzer. Swirl is lovely as well for the summer because I just, I don't really touch powders at all in the summer. Then we're going to go into Cha Cha. It looks really scary. It's not. It's a lovely, um, a lovely corally. See? I mean, how beautiful is that? Mmm, it smells sweet today. I don't know why. Just to give me a nice fresh look. I know I'm reviewing a couple of products, but I think it's nice to show you the complete look and really quickly as well. I'm not going to apply it over my nose. I don't know what this trend is of applying blusher over the nose. I don't get it. Like, I understand that the nose can get uh, red on holiday, but I just think it looks awful. This is not how you're taught to make up at makeup school, guys, okay? Um... <laughs> right starlight um i'm actually due a new highlighter uh from trini um there's a i think there's one called candlelight that i really want to get ahead of my holiday so fingers crossed i can get that but this is starlight uh, as you can see it's uh quite empty i also have sunlight which has this is more silvery silvery gold sunlight is more sort of uh golden and then candlelight i think is sort of in between but can we just appreciate that highlight it doesn't sit in the crinkly wrinkles um which a lot of highlighters can do just so you know so if you have crinkly wrinkles aka happy line guys you know i call it happy lines um a cream highlighter is basically what you want with no glitter inside it, may I add. Um, there we go. Why am I putting it on my nose? Well, it just gives me a little bit more freshness, doesn't it? There we go. Hello, glow. Um, 
just so you know, by the way, going back to Cha Cha, it's a lip to cheek. So, you can apply it on your lips. I don't really want it. Oh, blue neck. That is beautiful. I love that. And then I'm going to go in with Dido. Dido. Dido is empty. And I think I knew an easy new one. Mm. Oh, amazing. Gloss, gloss, gloss. And whatever's on your hands, don't get rid of it in a tissue. Who ever told you to do that? Just pop it on your cheeks for an extra bit of glow and not in your hair. So there we go. I only used half of my stack this time. Um, that's my favorite one, Schmuggy. That's my favorite, favorite blusher in the world. And by the way, these stay on your skin beautifully. Right, just pop it all on my decolletage. There we go. This spot is still highly offensive. I'm wondering if I can zap it a little bit more. Can we zap away? More? Go away, blemish. Okay, great. So, do I want to powder my T-zone afterwards? Maybe. Alrighty, that's nice and fresh. So, makeup applied um, over de-stress face looking nice and fresh, ready for the summer. I'm now going to go in with Italics Aurora. I'm so excited. Um, all right, so very important with this Italic to ensure that that sponge stays on the product because that sponge stops the product from drying out because this formula does not like oxygen. When you close it, make sure it clicks. Well, you can't hear that. It's not even clicking. They've obviously changed it. Um, okay, so going back to my notes, this lovely italic is inspired by the Roman goddess of Italy, which you can definitely tell because it's very sparkly. Um, apply it with your finger in small strokes and we've already talked about replacing the sponge. Now there's a lot of different shades of the italics. Um, I just chose this one when I was at the event last week because I fell in love. And when you put an eyeshadow, on your hand and you swipe it and you go oh my god that's amazing you've got to buy it basically so there we go have a little look appreciate the gorgeousness i'm not going to take my middle finger because i end up swearing at you if i take it um so let's show you on my hand are we going about to do this in one swipe like all the cool youtubers out there ready Oh my god, I mean, that is just a copper, coppery, goldeny, just, I mean, get it on my eye now. Um, I'm going to apply it. Apply, apply with your finger. All right, put the sponge back. Check. Okay, let's go, let's go close so you can see. Holy moly's. Oh my god. Okay, so basically this is going to be my eyeshadow of um, the summer and I'm going away in two weeks. Oh my god. Oh my goodness gracious me. Okay. Alright. Sorry about that. Um, as you know, my, my camera likes to cut out after about half an hour. It's just stopped recording. Not really sure why. Anyway, I was getting very excited about my italics shadow. I've not used any brushes whatsoever. If I want to, then I'd just go through in my socket. But can you have a look at that? Wow. I mean, it's just beautiful. Be careful you don't pull it down too much. Because I have brown eyes, but they're sort of quite auburn, like light brown, colours like this is going to help my brown eyes become lighter and brighter okay I mean you just you hardly need any I can't actually cope with how beautiful this color is I mean and it works beautifully with the cha-cha lip because I haven't applied too much I've used it more sort of like a stain with the dido on top these colors sort of marry together and it's really pretty. 
Um, this could, this is basically an example of how you can go from day to night, guys, just having your de-stress and a bit of blush on in the day and then going on in the evening with your eyes and you can bring it up into the socket as well. I'm going to sparkle underneath my eye. Now technically, you're supposed to apply your, let's see if this is gonna work. It's better with the finger, but let's see. I do have the, um, the Trini brushes, but just not with me clean right now. So let's just see how well this goes on with the brush. Because I'd quite like to, there we go. I just wanted to subtly, subtly sparkle underneath. So basically now, I have to go and buy the rest of the italics range. Thanks Trini. I just can't even deal. I can't deal with the sparkle. Oh my God, it's amazing! Does anyone else get excited about makeup or is it just me? <coughs> Blue neck. All right, should we go a bit more sparkly? Why not? I'm gonna go in into my socket a little bit more, scarf a bit higher. I'll tell you what would be nice in the socket, Fortune. That's another colour by Trini that is gorgeous. You can do that in the socket just to define a bit more. Um, and then you could go in with sort of Empress if you wanted to, which is a, I think it's Empress, a dark brown and smoke up in the corners if you really wanted to create a ethereal smoky sexy eye. But there we go guys, blooming amazing. I'm gonna shut my eyes and hopefully you can have a nice look at the eyeshadow. Should we just put it on one more time? <laughs> oh God. Um, so there we go. You know, you don't make up, you don't have to. First of all, apply the sponge. Apply the sponge. <coughs> I didn't plan very well because I don't have a tissue down here. Um, that is just absolutely dreamy. And I'm gonna sit and have my ginger tea now. And just move my face so you can see the lovely makeup. So, tiptoe, de-stress, italics. You have been a wonderful, wonderful purchase. I'm very grateful for you coming into my life ahead of holiday. And guys, I hope you've enjoyed my tutorial. It's been a lot of fun. I'm very obsessed with my eyes right now. Um, go and treat yourself to an italics. It's a really nice gift for someone as well. If you've got any questions, comment below. It's all about the glow today, guys. Bring on summer, it's gorgeous, and have a just a fabulous, fabulous day. Love you so much. Bye.